This church has a unique history and truly captures the essence of the town of Dalkeith. St Mary's Church was built around 1835 as the Buccleuch family's private church at Dalkeith. Designed and built by Bryson Burns, it stands as a symbol of the wealth of the estate in the 19th century. This complex was built by William Adam, the Regency architect, in 1740. It could accommodate around 60 horses. Once the Buccleuch family no longer had use for the stables, other purposes were found. From 1932 to 1989, it housed about 300 greyhounds, which were kept for racing by Scottish greyhound owners. What does Dalkeith mean to you? It means um, a lot of things. It means uh, from its, its in inception it was a market town. Um, it's very much my home now. Uh, I live in the middle of the estate on the edge of Dalkeith and Dalkeith is enjoying a sort of um, re regeneration at the moment um, with traffic being a major problem in it, the traffic is being diverted around it and it will soon be a, pleasant, a much more pleasant place to live. What does Dalkeith Country Park provide for the town itself? It's a very valuable breathing space. It, it, we, we live in a conurbation of Edinburgh now and it's, it's going to be a, a much more valuable place in the future when everything else is built up round about it and it's the last living green space that you can walk in. It's a very valuable area. What do you think the future holds for the town of Dalkeith? Uh, very open question that. It's, uh, it's, a, it's a vibrant town. I, I think it has a danger of being subsumed by a, a larger, its larger neighbour, Edinburgh, and become part of the conurbation. But it, it still has a, 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 an ethos of all of its own. It, it, it still maintains its market town ethos, as, as does Haddington and Musselburgh. As the rest of the town moves on, this will always remain a sanctuary for the true spirit of Dalkeith.